Plans have been announced regarding phase three testing for a leading COVID-19 vaccine. Biotech company Moderna says their late stage trial for the mRNA-1273 vaccine will begin in July. Moderna had initially tested out three dose levels, but are only moving forward with one of them. So here to tell us which one was selected is our chief health editor, Dr. Parthenandi. Doc. Hey, Glenda and Alan. So, you know, the vaccine is, is really it, right? That's how we're going to be able to beat this, uh, this virus. And Moderna is moving forward with their 100 microgram dose, and they had tested out higher and lower doses, but they found out that the preliminary results that the 100 microgram dose produced antibodies, and quote, at or above levels found in patients who had recovered from the coronavirus. And on top of that, the researchers actually selected a small group of their participants and tested their antibodies against the virus to see what it would do. And the antibodies successfully were able to neutralize the virus, which is great. And that's exactly what you want to happen. So just hearing about a vaccine, this is really exciting news. But the question now becomes how many participants will actually take part in this trial? And will they just get one shot or will they get more than one? And Ali, you're absolutely right. It's super exciting. And, and what, what's going to happen is a 100 microgram dose will be split uh, between two shots. Participants, you know, for phase three will range in age. Most of them will be between the ages of 18 and 55, but there will be some elderly folks included as well. Now, Moderna expects to have 30,000 participants. However, not all of them will be given this vaccine. Some will get placebo or what we call dummy shots instead. Now, as when, when we expect to hear the results, it won't likely be until November or December of the year of this year. So a few more months to wait to see if this vaccine is going to work. But uh, it's exciting. So is phase three the final stage, Doc? And if so, then what happens? So, Glenda, when a vaccine a candidate starts phase three, it means it's in the cl uh, final clinical trial phase. Super critical here because it'll give us most of the safety data, right? And so it'll tell us what the side effects may be and if there are any long-term uh, side effects as well. It'll also tell us how effective it was when compared to placebo, that the vaccine, how, co how effective it is compared to placebo. If it does well, that the vaccine does well, it, it can seek approval from the U.S. FDA. And as I said before, many vaccines, however, don't survive stage two or three. In fact, the FDA says only 25 to 30 percent of drugs in phase three trials actually get approved. So, Doc, is it the plan to start manufacturing millions of doses before the vaccine has proven that it actually works? That's right, Alan, it's a little unique, right? Doses of the vaccine will actually be manufactured before we actually know if it works. Why? Because there are over 300 and what, 30 million folks that are Americans and over 7 billion people that live on this earth. So we need to kind of hit the ground running once we know the vaccine works. The good news is that the health officials say Moderna plans to have a close to 100 million doses by late fall and early winter, and they plan to have between 500 million and uh, to 1 billion doses by January 2021. I, like I'm sure billions of people around the world, are really excited to get uh, a vaccine so we can really put a dent in this, uh, this virus and, and defeat it. Thank you, Dr. Nandy. That My is pleasure. Have a good weekend. Yes. You too. And if you have a coronavirus question for the doctor, you can email him, drnandy at askdrnandy.com, or be sure to send it to us on Facebook or Twitter.